Alright, good afternoon everybody. Today we're going to react to Mercury's letter to Nipsey. Um, as probably a lot of you know, Nipsey Hussle was killed, uh, I think last week. We reacted to one of his songs last week and this is the first time we actually had heard of him. Um, learning more about him, very tragic uh, what happened to him and uh, just what he did in his community. Um, but So yeah, Mercury's did a song, uh, Letter to Nipsey, so we're going to check it out. It's a letter to Nick. You are a legend and your legacy will never forget. While well, the real ones die and I am fed up with this. It's frustrating, man. It's too much shit to get off my chest like that. Why the streets got to overpower talent? And why the streets should always have to end up on and I just... Wow. That, yeah. <laughs> that came out, uh... He leaves a good, like, point, though. Like, you know... Like, you know, if you have good music... Not that you can't leave a legacy, but a lot of times it's it's what you do with the you know the opportunity and the gift you're provided, you know that leaves the legacy. Right, and I reading some of the comments and stuff. You haven't had a chance to read them, but yeah, uh, Nipsey did an insane amount of stuff for people. They give him back. And, yeah, and uh, but that line, why does beef always have to result in violence? Like it sounds like this guy, the guy that killed him, was just jealous. Yeah, it sucks. Found out that you died like 20 minutes ago But even though I didn't know you that shit You're gonna hate me for this But I think you fucked up that line Cause I thought he said Why do the streets always overtake talent Yeah he did And then he went on to Why does beef always have to go end with violence oh. We can go back and listen to it Just to prove you wrong Yeah that's fine I just I didn't hear that part Okay. Like that Why the streets gotta overpower talent And why does beef should always have to end up on And I just found out that you died like 20 yes. minutes ago And even though I didn't know you That shit dead in my soul 33 years old And had a couple kids of his own Just had a Grammy nomination too This shit is too cold Instead of pulling all the triggers Take a different approach To top it off It just got shot up Right up front of his store Like damn The other night I watched this interview you did Where you talked about Buying property To give back to the kids And now you'll never have a chance to This just how it is So I'm praying for your children So don't get through all of this Catch me riding through my city Doing victory laps Wow <clears throat> Man, that's the thing I love about Mercules. Like, his music, his music can be pretty deep. Yeah, and it's like it's literally every other comments I'm reading on our video and stuff like that, and other videos, like they're all saying exactly what he's saying. Yeah, and it's uh, but he's just putting it into a really, really good, good letter. Nipsey smoking sticky with a fifth on the dash My homie used to produce for you way back in the day He did that keys to the city beat, that shit had me amazed The cadence you had on records I just cannot explain He said he sent you a folder before you passed away You were one of the martyrs that I believe when they rap You were respected in the streets and you could see it wasn't capped Now we're saying goodbye to you This beef and shit is black, I had so many questions for you I ain't even get to ask Cause it's the ones who are winning becoming targets And it's the ones who... Stop that before she chews through her. Oh my god. <sighs> this dog. Okay, guess I gotta buy her a new collar now. <laughs> Apologize. Call victims that want star shit. So sick of losing it, these dudes become heartless. It's all the price that you pay for being an artist. But best believe the whole industry about to ride with you. These dudes jealous, so they shooting over pride issues. In the scene of Chihuahuas, you was a wild pit bull. You were a staple in the game, dog. I'll miss you. Having strong enemies is a blessing. That's what you tweeted this evening, man. What a head trip. Man, I can't even believe it. It's got me restless. I heard this beat and I need. That's crazy. So he tweeted. Having strong enemies is a blessing. Yeah. Which makes a lot of sense, because, like, it pushes you to be better. Yeah. But, like, this whole song is, like, so, like, <clears throat> like, you can tell, like, Mercury's, like, almost looked up to him in a way, you know what I mean? Yeah. And, like, I don't know, like, it's deep, like, this, I don't know. It's, I think it's explaining. It's weird rapping on something like this when it's so new. Yeah, you so know what recent. I mean? 
you don't usually hear something come out this quickly after something like this happens. But it's just, that's, yeah. Uh, it's, yeah. It's really weird. Need to put my two cents in. The whole game's trying to process what just happened. I bet Pac's got a room for you in Thug's Mansion. I'm only writing this as therapy, so fuck rapping. R.I.P. that hustle. It's funny, because Tupac has a song about that. Really? Yeah. Uh, what's it called? I'm trying to remember what it is. But yeah, I think it's like, is it Gangster's Paradise or something like that? Oh, yeah. The Tupac song? Yeah. But he talks about that, like... I can't remember if it's like, if there's a place in heaven for them, or something, like for thugs, you know what I mean? Like, right. I can't remember, but I do know that reference is right. off of Tupac. Yeah, that was, right. that was a good one. Yeah. When you had too much talent, my homie got your slogan tatted on his skin, on money in, on money out, baby, I'll get one just like him. Even though you passed away, just know your legacy still lives. Roll a blood, I pour some drink out and let's celebrate for that. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. It just sucks. Like, uh, you know, I it's I wish I would have known more about him before this happened. Yeah, no, for um, sure. But it's crazy how people like, like, you know, like you get the big name rappers that everybody knows about. Yeah. And some of them make trash music, but that's my opinion, obviously. Yeah. And some of them make really good music, but it's like, you know, and not to say that they're not doing anything, but guys like this that seem like they made such a big difference. Yeah. I've never heard of them. Yeah. yeah. Not to say that I've heard of, not to say that doesn't make, you know, him a big rapper. You know, I'm just saying, like, it seems like somebody who's done that much for a community right. should just, be highlighted more than well, at, at the same time, it's not a it's not a culture that we're involved we're, in at all. Well, we yeah, listen but I mean, to rap music, but it's like we don't go deep. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, I guess it just kind of shows you what the industry highlights. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because it's like you know, and and it kind of shows you like what people nowadays want to see. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because they're not. Like, a lot of times, the industry will highlight what people want to see. So, if yeah. they're not highlighting guys like this, then that's not really what, you know, the people who are fans of this industry want to see. Yes. Yeah. Like, well, that's the thing, too. He was fully independent his whole time. Really? Yeah. Never see one sign by anybody because he wanted all the, his money to go towards his family and, and helping people. Huh. So, um, yeah, it's too bad. I love how Mercules did it, though, because it was yeah. like, there was... Like, there was references, there was, like, small amounts of wordplay. Yeah. But it was cool because it was, like, it was a good song, like Mercury's always does. But it was a very, like, in a respectful... It just seemed like, it seemed more... What a kill the moment. Yeah. It, it seemed more just like, and he said it, this is more for therapy for me. Yeah. To me, it seemed like him, just, just some dude writing down his thoughts... Because he was getting it off his chest. Because he was hurt by what happened. Yeah. And it wasn't necessarily his like insane wordplay the whole time. It was just like yeah. I need to write this for myself, and then maybe this will you know help some other people go through this as well. Yeah. So. It's, like you can see you know like obviously you can see Mercury's talent in it, but it, yeah. yeah, it was respectful, well done. Exactly. You can tell that like he looked up to him. You yeah. know what I mean. Yeah. So. All right, guys. Thank you for watching. Please let us know what you think of this song and uh, continue to please give us suggestions yeah, um, any other information you guys have on like Nipsey yeah let you, us know you guys have given us a lot yeah. so far and we really appreciate that because we're definitely it's cool to learn all this because we're not like yeah we didn't know any of it no no <laughs> so we appreciate that and uh, again just continue to give suggestions because you guys have given us a lot we can't get to them all yeah but for such a small channel you've given us a lot and it's really cool so thank you guys for watching we'll see you guys next time